Gabon! What is going on guys, welcome back to the channel, it's Hayes to come with another video. Today, we're here at the Great Allianz Stadium in Sydney. We're back out here once again for a massive clash here on a Thursday night between my boys Sydney Roosters and the Parramatta Eels. It's going to be a big clash this one. Parramatta coming off a good win against, against the Parramatta Panthers last week. While the Roosters, fresh off the bye after beating the Rabbitohs two weeks before. So fresh, ready to go after a week, what, week off and we're ready to rip in. Big mother footy head for the Roosters. We've got Melbourne next week, Cronulla away, Anzac Day, Warriors away and then Magic Round against the Cowboys. So big month in the head for the Roosters and a big month ahead on the channel. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, favorite the video. Roosters win 1 to 12. My try scorer tonight is going to be Tupo Suali'i. He's going to shut everyone up. And Jackson Paulo has scored six in his last five against Parramatta. So he's in for a big game. All right, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. Follow me on TikTok, follow me on Instagram. You guys know the drill. All right, let's get in there, start the atmosphere. Can't wait. Karma Chooks, come on. into Wagga Blake, I think, one of the, the Penasini, one of the uh, Eels players, and they ruled it that he took him about the ball. Bullshit. Now Parra got the ball, and then he's got the, got the, got the attack now, so got to defend.
fucking keeping power in the game. That's bullshit. Moses kick it, make it 2 0. Oh, you're probably a good say that power of fucking that. Go Teddy! Go Jared! Go Jared! Come on boys! Come on! Go! Go Jackson! Go boys! Stadium, it's the Roosters, 16 Eels 2. Uh, really good first half. A uh, few errors, that handling errors hasn't helped us. But apart from that, been a really good first half. Thought Lindsay and Jared through the middle has been good. Hutchison's been good in the centres. Everyone's played their role tonight. Tupo's had an off night, but he's getting his on the scoreboard. So, but everyone's doing a roll. Uh, the big news, Tedesco's out of the game with a, um, with a head knock. Uh, it's not a category one, so hopefully he's right next week. But obviously, Robbo retrusts. He gets um, Corey Allen off the bench into the centres and still a lead fullback, so we should be okay. All right, second half about to get underway. Smashes Hodgson. He's the last. Gutho. Oh, there's a number. Oh, 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 that's actually a nice shot. Oh, Gutho scored. Oh, Mitt, that was a nice ball from Oh, what happened there? Oh. Come on! 
Go, Zoe! Jackson Paulo has scored five tries in four games for the Roosters. I love it, man. And it's so funny how that South said during the week that you know leaving South was the worst decision he ever made. <laughs> You're funny, South. Go to Wally! Go to Wally! Go to Wally! Get it! One-on-one stripped it and put him in the goal. What a moment, what a play. What a play, actually. That was good. Sam Wilson making a 14-point game with 15 minutes to go. Atta boy, Sammy! Atta boy, Sammy boy! Well done, boys. 26 to 8. What a crowd for a Thursday night at Alia. Red 
All right, full time here at Allianz Stadium. The Roosters 28, Eels 20. We've got the great Enter the Zane House with us, men. Yeah, what are your thoughts on the game? Well, mate, I thought the Roosters were really going to go on with it. I said uh, they'll keep. I thought Parramatta would defend a little bit better uh, in the second half, and they looked like they were running away with it with a 28 to 8 with the final 10 minutes. But I think there were some good signs for next week for Parra. Um, I thought, look, Dylan Brown. It's no secret, he's not having the best season early on. I thought some of his defence and the tackle early on, I forget who it was, it might have been Rhea Hargraves or Radley, there was a big tackle there, um, try-saving moments. So, yep. look, I'm proud of the boys' effort tonight. I thought there were some issues. I didn't agree with the early Simbin. I thought Bailey's Simbin was valid, but the Pettisini one... Um, yeah, it was, um, it, was, it was hard to see from where I was, but, look, I think there was a no-brainer, the... Um Simonson one. Is that the last draw for him? Is he out of the team next week? Well, it looked like he spent quite a bit of uh, time on the bench tonight. So uh, I, I think uh, between Wonga and Simonson for a few weeks now, and one week it's what then one week it's Simonson, one week it's Wonga, and this week probably next week, yeah. uh, Simonson might not be there against the Tigers. Yeah, definitely. A uh, big clash for you next week, Easter Monday. You guys lost to him last year, but how do you reckon you're going to go next week against the Eels? Yeah, uh, against the, the Tigers, sorry. Tigers. It's the Tigers home game, so they're going to be fired up, especially after their loss to the Broncos tomorrow. I'm already just going to say it. You're going to lose to the Broncos, Tigers fans. But, I did uh, say that the Tigers are winning. It's going to be uh, it's going to be fiery. you got IPAP going up against his old club. Um, it's always a good encounter there at Easter, so get down yep. if you can. I kind of wish it was at Bank West, whether it was a Tigers home game or not, but We've got some exciting games coming up, the Tigers and then the Bulldogs, so really looking forward to that game against the Bulldogs. It's going to be good, a little bit of shit talk between them two at the moment. Oh, no worries, thanks. thanks Hayden, always good, the pleasure to see you mate. No worries That's mate. a terrible Thank handshake, you. but we'll see you in the next vlog. Yes. At full time here at Allianz Stadium, Joey answers we like to call it Norman. Yeah. Norman from Sportshare TV has returned. Mate, hell on. I don't know. Another, uh, win, another good win? I'm your good luck charm, you're my good luck charm. Mate. 100%. It looks like we're going to go uh, undefeated here this season. Um, well, yeah. I'm three from three. Yeah. Four out of five at Allianz. That's it. We, so, don't, um, we don't include the semi final. No, it doesn't, doesn't count. I no, there, no, no, no. So, um, <laughs> it was, um, yeah, no, great win, to be honest. Losing Teddy, obviously, we had no Manu. Um, yeah. To, you know, scrappy in the end, we did concede a fair few points in the end, but it doesn't matter. We got the win, and we. Um, we played well in the in the first half to, to get it to that stage. Drew Hutchinson was one of the standouts as well. Yeah, I still can't believe so many people bag Hutcho. Like he's a great player. He yeah, can cover almost every position. He's literally the he's, new the new Orbo. Yeah, he's the new Orbo. I mean, he's, no one will ever be as great as Orbo, but to have no. someone like Hutchinson, uh, teams would teams would kill to have someone like him. on Hundred percent. Yeah, just does his role. Obviously, we had some standouts tonight too. Like obviously, I thought our forwards were good. Jared Lindsay off yeah. through the middle was good as well. But notably, Sam Walker in defence was good tonight too. Sam was so strong in defence, and then Kiri in attack, which really yeah. impressed me. Like, I'm, I'm so happy because no one knew how Kiri would, would come and play this year. When you know some people yeah. talking, saying like, "Oh, this might be his last year. He's one head knock away from the time and blah blah yeah. blah." Yeah, comes in and plays like that. I mean, mate, we're looking good all round. We just, we just keep proving everyone wrong. Is that's the great thing? That's what we always do. It, whether we're the favourites or the underdogs, everyone's always going to have yeah. something to say about the Chooks. Um, Hundred we'll, percent. We'll keep turning up. All right, no, don't, as usual, don't forget to follow us, Norman, on Sportsnet TV. Always great shit. Cheers, guys. Cheers, oh, Andy. Are you coming to Melbourne next week? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> I'm doing a solo mission. I'm doing oh, a solo no. mission. I'll be there. More. Enzac day. Enzac day. Yeah, yeah, we'll I'll see you. Enzac day. All right, all right, sweet. Catch you then.